In my other video around Bluetooth adapters, I showed you how to connect the Bluetooth to the MultiWii in a very simple way. If you've got one of these newer HC06 boards, you might have to do a little bit of configuration. So in this video, I want to show you how you do that to get it working. First of all, let's talk about how you connect this board to the PC. It's using our trusty friend, the FTDI adapter. And the way you connect them together is quite straightforward. You collect connect the power rails together, the positive and the negative, and then you connect the transmit to receive pin and receive mit to transmit pin, exactly as you would with anything else. Once you've done that, you plug that into your PC and then open our friend the Arduino program. Once you have that open, you make sure that obviously you have the right COM port selected. We're going to click on serial monitor. Now the serial monitor will allow us to talk to the board um, and change the bits and pieces that we need to. Now, MultiWii actually needs 115,200 board to talk to the Bluetooth. And some of these HC06 boards are coming configured for 9600. So here we are, we, we always have to have no line ending selected. We've got 96 board here. If I just type in AT, all the commands have to be in uppercase by the way, and hit enter, there we are, we get OK back. That absolutely confirms, one, we've connected the board properly, and secondly, it is running at 9600 board, which is the wrong speed for the multi-Wii. So, what we'll do is we'll change that board rate to 115,200 by typing AT plus board 8, click send. The board confirms that it's changed the board rate, so to continue talking to it, we need to change the board rate this end as well. Once that's done, I'll show you another couple of the cool things that you can do with the board while we've got it like this. The first one is to actually change the uh, name of the board, and the second is to change the um, pin number. So the first thing we'll do, let's just put AT again and hit return, just to confirm we are running at 115,200, there's the OK, so we are. To change the name, it's AT plus name, and then whatever you want the name to be. That's all done. So now in discoverable devices on whatever you're connecting to the Bluetooth module, it will be called that. The next thing you can do is you can also change the pin number to be whatever you want as well. By default, it'll be one, two, three, four. So now we've done all that, it's ready to connect to the um, multi-wii and use so just remember it's board 8 to select 115 200 and have it set to run with the multi-wii thank you for watching please comment and subscribe and happy flying